Hi friends, <clears throat> today I, again I am going to do a round brush um, painting. I am using various brushes here. Again these are all um, I bought from a uh, craft shop which is sells very cheap stuff from China. And these are all very soft synthetic brushes of various sizes. This is size 12. This is 3 and this is 1. This is Camlin size 0 brush. Uh, sorry, size 2. <coughs> so these are the various brushes uh, that I am using. You have to see if the brush cell is very soft and smooth. You can just pick that brush. I don't go with the brand as I always say. I am going to choose uh, green color. First we will be choosing green color on... Uh, uh, this is size 1 I don't know because you see from brand to brand the sizes do change because this is size 2 and it's much thinner and this is size 1 and it's much fatter so you better go for the um, like I decide uh, what I want to paint if I want to paint a thicker stem I go for a thicker uh, bristle and if I want to do some detailing work I go for size 1 2 or even 0 so depending upon what you want to do, what kind of uh, stem you want to paint, the thickness of the petals you want to paint. Yes, yesterday, uh, which the last video which I posted, I used the biggest size of the brush, although the again there was no brand on it. So it's all up to uh, the size of the bristles which you can see and decide which brush you can choose for what kind of strokes. So here I'm choosing this medium sized brush to make the uh, thicker stem I'm using four cut color uh, green I have a lot of color mixed up on my palette so it may be you you can be like you can see many colors even if I say green so I made this thick stem and I'm going to pick a little bit of yellow along with the green so that I get a finer looking color and it's also seen on the screen easily if you feel like you are not able to pull these strokes smoothly you can go for a thicker brush green and yellow so that's it now I'll put the brush in water and I'm going to pick a much uh, thinner brush you can use size 0 also because we want to make a very thin uh, lines for the stem of the flower so first set of lines will be um, this way like a coming from all the directions you can see then I will I'm again doing the same thing here uh, green and yellow I'm picking on my brush the second set will be coming from the middle of this two, this way and it will be little bit higher than the base stems, This uh, the stems which we did first. Just roughly randomly you have you are going to create a stems base for the flower I'm doing the same here quickly keep the brush very um, light handedly you have to handle your brush to get these thin lines
ओके मिडल वंस this is done this i'm leaving now now what i'm going to do is i'm going to pick purple uh, and white on um, another brush um, maybe the brush which with which i did the stem with the same brush if i want a bigger petal i may choose a bigger brush but here i think this is enough i will load my brush in purple and pick a little bit of um light yellow and <clears throat> the top now you have to uh, make this kind of it's totally yellow i need more of purple this kind of dots not dots you have to keep and push uh, pull it slightly i want a lighter purple here so i just blend my purple with little bit of white yeah this is perfect and i am going to randomly make this kind of strokes you can see what i am doing i am making a very simple just a little bit of press and pull press and pull press and pull press and pull okay same thing okay now on the outer directions uh, on the uh, mostly on the stems which are coming out i'm going to change my brush now i'll take that same um, thinner brush and i'm going to paint uh, flowers tiny little flowers out of this just loading my brush what i'm going to do is starting from this side 1 to uh, the color actually there is a bit of green and my purple has already mixed with the green okay from this side 1 2 3 to 4 2 3 4 better i'll show with the white color from here pull inside see from all the direction i am giving a rough pull towards the center this way one then then the center one to understand it much in a easy way you can do in a center one first then from both the side you can pull then the last one this way but it doesn't give you that natural look when you do roughly you get a very beautiful natural look that's my perspective oh there's a little bit of <laughs> i picked a little bit of orange and it's looking nice too i'll go for orange again back to white 
and it's white and orange now. Again. Again, I'll pick a little bit of white and orange. It looks good to add more color. And roughly I'm making these petals. And now what I'm going to do is I'm going to give a little bit of uh, highlight to the ones in the center. So I'm going to take and uh, make a rough this kind of strokes on some of the petals and leaving some of the petals as it is do whatever you want that's the beauty of decorative painting let your imagination flow freely okay now i want to add a uh, bud so i'm going to make a thin line here and maybe from here this way and one coming out here this way and i'm going to make a uh, choose any size of brush you want i'll choose a fatter one because we are going to make one thick stroke so i'll choose this fat one and what color maybe white and purple will be fine because our flower is white and purple so i'll choose white and purple and see with one stroke i'll just make a sharp pull and make this kind of strokes looks like giving it a look of a um, but here also pressing a bit and release it Okay, here, same way, so this is done, and I want to complete this also, so what I'll do is, roughly I'll go and make only the um, tiny petals this way, so it looks complete. See the magic of such a tiny brush. And we'll make some of the dots also in between. This way. Roughly some dots of that purple ones. And finally, I'll make some here down this way that's it so if you make this on a small canvas and paint it uh, and uh, um, frame it on a canvas board you can paint this and frame it it looks very beautiful anyways thank you thanks for watching keep watching do subscribe like and share i'll see you soon with another video bye